Hey everybody, this is Jake, your resident content cowboy here. Yeehaw, I'm just checking out this spectate mode. I think this match is live, but I'm like a couple minutes behind. There's some cool features here. So we see the score at the top of the screen. Are we also seeing... Oh, we're also seeing how many wild Pokemon people take down. Is that what I'm seeing? Oh, never mind. I'm seeing level. Okay. <laughs> I was seeing the number near their uh, faces tick up as they were taking down wild Pokemon. And I thought, oh wow, are we actually seeing who takes out as many wild Pokemon as they can? Let's see how the fast forward works. Yeah, up to 4X, 8X, wow, okay, cool. I don't wanna go crazy. Uh, from what it looks like, I'm behind the real time match right here, but this is pretty dope so far. Can I switch? No way! Wow, 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 wow. This is cool. Oh, I gotta, I gotta cast some like high-level games doing this. I gotta find some good ones to bring to you. We've got this uh, Cinderace hiding in the jungle here. Got caught out by that uh, Nine Tails right there. The Nine Tails let him know that he was there, obviously. Wow, they're taking him though. I mean, three on three on two with that uh, Greninja and bot lane just getting beat up on. Let's head back. I wanted to take a look at this Greninja because I don't see a lot of Greninja play. So that was actually the reason I pulled this one up. This is a top ranking Greninja player. I just wanted to see what was happening here. So let's see. Uh, they're getting dove on right here. Snorlax and Pikachu are just brutal together, aren't they? When you're dealing with them in lane, they're so mean. Look at that. They're so mean. We've got Machamp in their jungle and Cinderace in blue team's jungle. Red team, is it orange team or red team? I guess orange team and purple team. <laughs> I said blue team, but I think it's orange and purple, right? So purple team, well the team on the left side, the team that we started spectating is behind. They're 67 to zero right now. Let's see, they're all heading bot. Let's see what this fight looks like in the bottom lane. We've got Machamp down there. Yeah, trying this Alola Ninetales is trying to deal with it, but you know, when you have multiple Pokemon on you, even if you're good, it's just what are you gonna do? How are you gonna get them out of there? I love that we've got a Wigglytuff here. This Wigglytuff putting them all to sleep, and look at that Alola Ninetales is just—it's like a turret when it's inside its Aurora Veil right there. So we still have two members of the purple team. Or blue team, however we want to look at it. Am I colorblind? We still have two members of the uh, purple team top. And Dreadnought is now here. We've got four members of the orange team fighting. And we've only got three purple right here. Watching this Ninetales. Let's Cinderace. Oh boy, this does not look like a good engagement for blue. Purple. Who knows? No one knows what colors are. Yeah, this uh, Greninja's got to run. He's just, he's done. I'm actually surprised he's coming back to poke here. I don't, I wouldn't do that, but. Oh, well, we got Slowbro here. Maybe they're going to try something. Oh, he's looking to go for a steal. They've actually all got, uh, like, really low health. So I kind of get the thought process here. He was able to tag one. Oh, this might be why he's one of the top players. Whoa! Whoa! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> that was great. He was just melted them. He stole two KOs, he stole Dreadnought. What a champion, what a hero. And they're just crushing this goal here. He could have waited for Wiggly Wigglytuff there and gotten a little extra score, but I think he just thought, hey, I wanna deposit these 40 points. So we're watching this Greninja just crush it right now. And if I wanted to at any moment, I could pause. Very cool, all right. I can't rewind though, right? Can I? I don't think so. I don't see that option. But wow. Okay. Wow. This Greninja is doing some good work. Enemy. I'm an, I'm an enemy fan now. I'm going to get my enemy t-shirt. Could you imagine <laughs> if after this he doesn't have one? I just go home and I start printing out merch for this Greninja that I watched. All right. This team fight's getting a little wild. Ooh, we got a nice Unite move from Greninja. I feel like you never see good Unite moves from Greninja. No wonder this guy's one of the best in the world. Uh, gonna take Rotom here. Now the question is, do they let Rotom go in or are they gonna dunk and then... Okay. 
taking out the two front goals. I'm not super opposed to it because it really cuts off your enemy's, uh, you know, positioning. But it also makes your team, you know, have some terrible plays. Oh, wow. So this is a Surf Greninja. This Greninja's rocking Surf and... You can't have Surf and Water Shuriken, right? It's either Surf or Water Shuriken. So this is a Surf Greninja. And that's probably how he was able to secure those KOs. Is just with a, a few great Surfs. Because every time you KO someone with Surf, wild Pokemon or enemy Pokemon, it resets the cooldown. So we're just seeing him pick at people off. I wonder if Greninja is going to raise in popularity now that Cinderace has had a little bit of a nerf. We'll see. I mean, I, from the matches I've played, I feel like Cinderace is still an absolute monster here. So we've got another Dreadnought fight happening, and it's five on five. We've got everyone here. The Pikachu is throwing at our Greninja. We've got this Cinderace using its Unite move and diving. Pikachu used its Unite move, but I think a little bit too late. Snorlax is getting all its health back. Their Greninja pop, their Unite move, and he is focusing on this Snorlax right now. We have Slowbro in the bottom right, and now Greninja is just getting dove on right here. I think it's over for Greninja. Goodbye, Greninja. Goodbye. We got Wigglytuff coming down, but I mean, what's the point at this point? You're just going to get eaten alive, right? Right? Where are we at? Let me see that tough. Oh, this Greninja gets out by the skin of their teeth. We've got Ninetales just doing some work. I mean, Alola Ninetales is absolutely amazing. Pushing the Snorlax away. Who else is over there? Is it that Slowbro still? Boy, I'm not being I'm not controlling this fast enough. I gotta get more used to this. So the Slowbro, oh, is just getting eaten up. This Machamp zoning it out. Well, look at that surf. Great surf. And then double back-to-back uh, -back unite moves from Ninetales and <laughs> Ninetales. We're seeing a huge Machamp Unite move. Wigglytuff's getting dove on. That's the end of that Wigglytuff here. And Cinderace, I think, has said, you know what? This is done. I am moving back, and I'm going to be farming right now. Cinderace is level 13. We've got a level 13 Cinderace. The other team has a level 13 Machamp. So our junglers are doing very, very well. Level 14 Cinderace. I mean, that's where you want it to be. We've actually got a fight happening here. I missed it, but they just collapsed on that slow bro in the middle. Low... Uh, low level from Pikachu right now, but their Cinderace is 14. Where is our hero Greninja at? 11. Low level from Pikachu and low level from Greninja right now. Obviously, we want both of them to be a higher level by the time Zapdos comes. Hopefully, 13 if you can. I like being level 13 by Zapdos if at all possible. But you want your carries to be your highest level. So, your Greninjas, uh, your Cinderaces. Usually, someone like that would be in the jungle. You know, your jungle's probably going to be your highest level by the time Zapdos comes out as long as you didn't do a horrible job. They're just collapsing on this slow uh, Snorlax right now, but it's, you know, it's a really hard one to get rid of. They're going to take this Alola Ninetales here. Whoa! The Buddy Barrier from Pikachu and a Unite move from Greninja, and that was devastating, it feels like. The, I mean, you traded, but it feels like Purple Team is trading too hard here. And now... Cinderace is just saying, I'm going to take this. It's looking for its level 15 right now as the fight's happening up here. Alola Ninetales is just being taken out by this enemy Greninja. They're behind here. Purple team is behind, and this Machamp is just trying to wrestle this, this uh, Cinderace to the ground. Cinderace is going for a score right here. I don't love this. We are having the Zapdos get attacked right now. So... I mean, Cinderace is getting some points, but if they can't steal this Zapdos, it's game over. And there's that Zapdos. Boom. I don't see a way around this at this point. They need to they need to score these goals, but it shouldn't be tough. They've left these goals up for themselves. We've got 100 points here. We've got 100 points here. If Ninetales can make it, we've got another 100 points from Ninetales coming in. Run, Ninetales, run! Yeah. Big, big scores here. Big scores. And, oh, does, is Snorlax going to deposit too? Is he going to make it? Yeah, Snorlax made it too. I mean, that Zapdos fight was everything right there. And while I understand, I think, what Cinderace was maybe trying to do, if they don't take Zapdos, then Orange Team might not be able... To, well, Orange Team won't be able to win, especially given that 100 score difference. But when they had Zapdos right there, it felt like, well, what's what are we going to get out of you scoring those points at the bottom? I don't think much. So we're seeing the match wind down now. 307 to 547. That's an orange or red, depending on whether or not you have colorblindness win. What a match.
Wow, what a match. And man, I really, that Greninja was really, really great. Pretty great match. And what a cool mo spectate mode. Who knew? This is going to be fun. I'm going to have to spectate some of these matches with some of these really good players. Oh, and it just kicks me out. Okay, it didn't show me the end screen. Well, thank you everyone for watching. Thank you for listening. I hope you enjoyed that. I had a lot of fun my first time spectating a match. I will see you all next time. Mwah.